got Quickie Rubs when I squeak his rubber carrot. Go, Speedy, go! Water rig, distill water straight from Mr. Germain's science lab. And let's not forget his Friday treat. Scientifically tested vitamin fortified hamster croutons. Garlic flavored are his favorite. Hey, slow down, Speedy. You've got to pace yourself or they won't last the weekend. Okay, people, have a good weekend. Remember, Monday is Positive Energy Day. Bye, Speedy. See you Monday. Got the garter snake. Fifth grade's got the horny toad. But we, we got Speedy. Will you guys hurry up. We got some major playing to do. Take it easy, big guy. Good morning, people. Good morning, Miss Rokey. Rise and shine, Speedy. It's Monday. Speedy. Hey, Speedy, wake up. What's wrong, Mikey? I don't know. Speedy's just lying there. Perhaps he's sick. Speedy? Nah, he's just tired, that's all. Yeah, he had a big weekend. Sitting around, sleeping, eating croutons. But TJ, he didn't eat his croutons. Now, don't panic, people. I'm sure Speedy's fine. He's probably just, uh, you know, in some sort of hamster hibernation. But, Miss Grokey, hamsters don't hibernate. Oh, well, then, um, uh, perhaps he's meditating. A little meditation is a great way to start your day. So why don't we... Oh, no! Speedy's not meditating, Miss Grokey. He's... he's... Speedy's dead! Two out! Nobody on! Plays to first! Hey, am I the only one playing here? Sorry, Spinelli. I just can't keep my mind off Speedy. Yeah, me neither. I just keep thinking about how he used to run on his wheel all day. And how he used to tickle my face with his whiskers. And how he used to zip through my maze without ever getting lost. Oh, I kept trying to tell myself he was just a hunk of DNA, but who am I kidding? Speedy was special. Special? He was a hamster. Go down to the pet store. They got a million of them, and they're all the same. Maybe to you, Spinelli, but to me, he was special. He was my friend, and I, I, I killed him. I pushed him too hard with that squeaky carrot. <laughs> oh, come on, Mikey. It wasn't your fault. I was the one who gave him that stupid distilled water. No, it was those croutons, those garlic croutons. His little heart couldn't take so much seasoning. Listen, if it makes you feel better, you all killed him, okay? Now can we play? Come on, you guys. It was nobody's fault. It was just... It's time to go. I know. It's just... I wish I could have said goodbye to the little guy, if that's all. Too late now. Oh, yeah? Says who? Well, it seems a pretty obvious postulate, TJ. Hey, it's never too late to say goodbye. Speedy was our friend. Our good friend. And I say we give him a funeral. A funeral? For a hamster? Hey, yeah. Give the little guy a proper send-off. A memorial service to share our heartfelt sentiments. We'll get some other kids to help us. It'll be great. Let's do it. Why do I have a feeling my whole recess just got wrecked? Sorry, guys. We're both solid. First, we gotta dig him up for King Bob. Then we got a bomb shelter for that weird new science teacher. And then... But this is for Speedy. Speedy the hamster? Why didn't you say so? Yeah, Speedy was a great digger. We'd be honored to help. A funeral for a hamster? Well, I do need a new dress. Something simple and black. Plus a hat with a veil. And accessories. Oh, I have a hill photo series. I'll get a scarf and shoes. shoes. And we have matching bags. Oh, I have a hill photo series. Now, this here is the best plot in the playground. Normally, something like this would set you back a pretty penny. But because it's for Speedy, you can have my all-in-one burial package, which includes a foam padded shoebox uh, coffin at a mere two bucks over cost. You got yourself a deal. Hey, wait a minute. I'm not coughing up my milk money to bury a hairball. Oh, come on, Spinelli. It's for Speedy. Hey, what do you kids think you're doing over there? Whoops, gotta go. Oh, uh, hey there, King Bob. Your, your Highness, sir. We, we were just, uh, um... Digging a hole. Digging a hole? In sixth grade territory? How dare you? Take them to the dodgeball wall. Oh, you don't understand, Your Majesty. We're having a funeral for Speedy. For Speedy? The hamster? I didn't even know it was sick. Why, when I was a mere fourth grader like yourselves, I used to talk to Speedy and tell him my hopes and dreams. Of course you can bury Speedy here. In fact, I, King Bob, will personally give the eulogy. What is with you people? Have you all gone insane? It's a hamster. A dumb little, insignificant, $2.58 hamster! What's eating her?
playground, we are gathered here today to say goodbye to Speedy. Speedy was more than a hamster. He was a friend. In fact... Hey, are we late? And you are... Vic Vermicelli, captain of the high school football team. Me and the guys came over as soon as we heard. We only knew Speedy back when we were in the fourth grade. Heck, he used to be like a mascot to us. <laughs> okay, fine. Stand over there. Way over there. Anyway, for some of us, Speedy was a friend. For others, a mascot. For others... So, did we miss anything? You bus drivers knew Speedy, too? Uh, sure. Back in fourth grade, we probably played with Speedy more than we played with cars. Great, fine. Just stand over there with the big blubbering guy. Anyway, like I was saying, a friend, a mascot, a playmate, Speedy was all of this and more. In fact... I've come to pay my respects to a great hamster. Mayor Fitzhugh, you knew Speedy? Knew him? Huh. I owe everything to this little guy. Back when I was a fourth grader, this little hamster was my only friend. He never laughed at my hopes, at my dreams. He just ran round and round in his little wheel, telling me in his silent way, Keep moving, Fitzhugh. Keep moving and they'll never indict you. Thanks, Speedy. I'll never forget you. 1956? That's more than 40 years ago. Anyway, like I've been trying to say, friend, mascot, playmate, soulmate, Speedy meant a bunch of stuff to a lot of us and, well... Ah, heck, just bury the little fluffball. everything about him. His cute little nose, his cute little paws. I'll never forget the first day he looked up at me with those black beady eyes and I saw love. That's right, love! I'll never love another hamster again. Uh, leave us alone! Uh, speedy! Speedy! Speedy? Hey, did Speedy always have a little spot under his chin? Spot under his chin? No way! Speedy had a stripe down his back. Stripe? Speedy had little white paws like running shoes. Running shoes? Speedy was brown from head to toe! No, I don't know. Hey! This one's female! What? Yeah, the one in the picture is a girl, but the Speedy I always knew was a boy. But that means they're not the same hamster! <laughs> How can this be? Perhaps I can explain. Miss Brokey? You see, the average hamster only hangs out on this planet for a couple of years, and, well, uh, we teachers weren't sure if you kids could handle the metaphysical ramifications of, you know, death. What are you trying to say, Miss Grokey? Well, it's like this. From the day this school was built, every fourth grade class has had a hamster named Speedy. And whenever one died, we teachers would secretly replace it with a new one before any of you found out. You mean you lied to us? Lie is such a harsh word, Mikey. I prefer to say we massaged reality. That explains it. In order to have known all these people, Speedy would have to have been alive for decades. But that means this isn't my Speedy. Or mine. Or mine. Come on, guys, let's go. Wait! Don't try and stop us, boy. We could become an ugly mob. Now hold on. You're all acting like babies. I am not. I want my Speedy. Yeah, Me too. My speedy. Look, maybe this Speedy wasn't your Speedy or yours or mine. The fact is, every Speedy was a Speedy to somebody. And just because there's more than one, doesn't change what any of us felt about them. And it doesn't change what they taught us either. How to make a bed out of wood chips. How to enjoy even the stalest piece of bread. How fun it can be to just run in circles. And most important... How to be a friend. We gathered here today to honor a great hamster. Only now we get to honor a lot of great hamsters. Not just my speedy, but yours, and yours, and yours, and even yours. So what do you say? Let's do this thing right. For speedy! I hereby declare this the tomb of the unknown speedy! <laughs> speedy, we hardly knew ye.